CA Productions invites you to join us for Coastal Connections with Courtney. This new and exciting television program is designed to showcase wonderful things taking place in South Mississippi. Join Courtney Anderson as she personally takes you on a journey all along the Mississippi Gulf Coast. You'll meet many local leaders, business owners, and interesting people who make a positive difference in these communities. Coastal Connections with Courtney will also showcase a wide variety of great places to eat, shop, and explore. There's so much to see in South Mississippi. So come along for the ride and enjoy Coastal Connections with Courtney. Hi everyone and welcome to Coastal Connections with Courtney on another Sunday. Here we are in Biloxi, Mississippi, located on the top level of Keesler Federal Credit Union. Today we get to know and hear from CEO, Mr. Andy Swagger. everyone so here we are located in the top floor of the office of CEO Mr. Andy Swagger of Keesler Federal Credit Union and Andy I want to thank you for this opportunity and allowing me and the Mississippi Gulf Coast get to know you and what all goes into your large company. I'm glad to be here looking forward to looking forward to talking with you. Well I know it has doubled in growth grown exponentially since you have started but I want to rewind because it's quite interesting, your background and how you got up here and your experience, if you will tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, so, so I came from, uh, originally I'm from Ohio. Okay. Right? Cold weather, really, really tired of cold weather. So mm -hmm. ended up in Dallas and I was the chief financial officer for the largest credit union in Dallas. And however, um, I got that opportunity because the credit union was, was troubled. Um, they, they were actually, taken over by the the government so they had they had failed and they had brought me in and um, uh, you know along with putting together a team and whatnot mm. put together a plan and it was it's actually the largest turnaround ever for a credit union that credit union has now um, come out of insolvency and is is a is a wonderful credit union called Texans Credit Union in Dallas well, from just various experiences, you just dove into it and you did a total turnaround. Was it you, a team, it was, it's, it's, expertise? It's, yeah, it's all. It's always a team. Uh, sure. I, I have a finance background, um, managing balance sheets and whatnot, and had a couple connections there. I knew I knew that if I wanted to get into the right. business at that level, um, I wasn't going to get to just walk into a perfectly run organization. Right. It was going to be something that needed a little. I shouldn't say a little bit of work. We we worked. It's complete Probably, turnaround. Yeah, it, it was uh, it was Monday through Saturday, and every other Sunday for seven years. Um, but um, it, it's it's very fulfilling, and we turned the place around. But it, it also, um, I get a lot of the credit for it. But it, it it really you cannot do something like that without it being mm -hmm. a full team effort. Well, I mean, I, the first thing when you Google Andy Swagger, CEO, you know, Mississippi Gulf Coast, that is one of the things that comes right under your name, the huge turnaround, the milestone that you said. Yeah, so, so that, that's, that's probably, I, I shouldn't say probably, that is what afforded right. me the opportunity for this job here because Keesler Federal was not like Texans. Keesler Federal, um, this was a well-capitalized mm -hmm. organization. Um, and and uh, just just a great organization, even before I got here. So I was blessed to come in here. Um, it just needed something a little bit different. So I know you and your wife, y'all were, were Texans, and mm -hmm. um, y'all brought so much flair to the Mississippi Gulf Coast. When exactly did you move over? So, so we've been here now for six and a half years. And I, I, I have to tell you, um, I, me and my wife and my kids, I absolutely love living here. I mean, it's That's so yeah. We, we, awesome. we came from Dallas, and Dallas is a big city, and it's fast and it's moving it is. quick. But if you're uh, raising a couple of kids, mm -hmm. and um, I, I just cannot think of a better place. Let me let me tell you a really funny, quick story. Yes. Um, 
so the Powerball was like $2 billion okay. the last couple of weeks. And my kids thought it would be funny to play. We don't typically play the lottery, but we bought, a, we bought, <laughs> we bought lottery tickets. Yeah. My daughter says, I hope we don't win. And I was like, what are you talking about? She said, because I don't ever want to move away from here. Uh -huh. She literally said that to me. So um, we're, we're blessed. We love it. We love it here. Um, the, the people are, are, are genuine and they're, they're fabulous and they're helpful. And, uh, you know, we have more friends here in the short time we've been here than what we ever had in Dallas. Yeah, and that is one of the things about my show. I, the, I love, you know, promoting prominent leaders as well as family per people that have their priorities in spiritual life and physical and all, you know, very prevalent within their routine. Mm -hmm. And you've only been here six years. You and your wife are very entrenched and have dove right in and everyone knows of y'all as well as you're helping a lot of people. Yeah, well, it, it helps to be the CEO of Keesler Federal. Yeah. Okay. Um, well, yeah, I, well, well, Keesler. It's so, doubled. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you so, have to say. so we have, and that's, that's, that was the mm -hmm. unique thing. Uh, Keesler was a, was a very healthy organization. Now, in the last, since I've been here, we, we have doubled in size. Mm -hmm. um, we have 40 branches now. We have four and a half billion dollars in total assets. We're in Louisiana, Alabama, Mississippi, obviously. And we have branches in the United Kingdom. Um, so the organization is very, very healthy, but it, it, it takes a, a full team. Um, yeah. I, I probably get too much credit for, for what's happened here, uh, starting with our board of directors. Mm -hmm. our, our board of directors have actually put together a, uh, a, a brilliant plan. And that plan is not focusing so much on the, on the profitability and all these things. They're, they're focused on giving back to the community. And that's where they've, they've taught me, you know, I, I come in here as a finance guy, hard charging. We're yeah, Dallas, gonna, yeah, bam, yeah. bam. And they kind of slowed me down and said, hey, you know what? This is a community place down here. We're, we're gonna it give is. back to the community. And it, it, it has helped our business exponentially. And I wish I could take credit for it, but uh, that, that idea comes from the board of directors. I'm here to execute their plan. But then from me, now I have 800 other team members here mm -hmm. And uh, our, our team is second to none. Um, I have 100% confidence in everything we do. And there's nothing that we can't do. And that's literally yeah. how we look at things. And I love that you know their names, you're personally yeah, involved, yeah. they can call you if they have a problem, an issue. Yeah. You know, you can't do that with every CEO or a boss. You have to go through a certain thing, but the community, the family values, it's all within Keesler. Yeah, and that's, that's, that's why I love it here mm -hmm. because that, doesn't exist in Dallas. It just yeah. doesn't exist. You don't even know who your neighbors are. Um, and I'm an outgoing person and I, I love being around other people, but, yeah. but this this community, um, it, it, it's it's great for that. That's it is. Yeah. I mean, you go to Rouse's, I mean, it's who's who. You're like, I see people, you know, that I've known my whole life and I'm born and raised here. My family is, my great grandparents, long chain of it. But I'm very fascinated and um, intrigued by people like you and your wife mm -hmm. that have been in an environment like Dallas, Texas, Ohio, you know, and come down here and just dive right in and make such huge milestones. We love it. Uh, to, what do you do? What do you love about it? I, I love the weather. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Too. The weather's warm. Um, we, we, I, I, live, I live in Gulf Hills, all right? It's this little community. And is that Ocean Springs? It, it's right outside Ocean Springs, okay. right there. And we we take the boat out. We go to Horn Island. I mean, Horn Island is. And take is, the kids. Oh, of course. We we take our kids everywhere. Yeah. Okay. I love that, seeing y'all the, family uh, pictures. My, my son plays basketball. My daughter plays soccer. Mm -hmm. We're we're very involved in, in in the kids' activities. Not to a point of where it's every single night we have to do this because. That's not how we are. Yeah. Um, we've embraced this laid back culture and, and we like to slow down, um, mm -hmm. but love being outside. I mean, uh, I was just mentioning Horn Island. That place is majestic. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, who knew? I, Had y'all ever experienced no, something like that in no, Dallas? Of course not. Well, I didn't even know it until after uh, a year or so that we were here. Yeah. And someone says, hey, we're going to go out the island. I'm like, going out the island. And your wife Renee loves it too? Oh, she loves it as well. And, and 
look, I, I'm blessed, okay? Yeah. Renee is, she's special. She's, she she's, is, uh, and she is doing major things around the community she as is. well. She is, she is. Uh, she, just this morning we were talking, uh, she's volunteering at the Home of Grace. Okay. Um, she, she is a, okay, so she's a wonderful, yoga instructor yes she's i like to call her the yogi goddess okay and yes she's and she's so healthy lady. gorgeous natural yes, she yes. is just the epitome of well, a beautiful well, that's, healthy woman yeah that's that's because she encompasses a, a, a full uh holistic approach to it i mean yeah. she, she actually has a uh, uh, yoga wellness it's a brand where it's not just the the yoga side of it but it's it's the whole picture of promoting wellness your diet mental health all, all right. of those things so she's doing that she's a perfect example of it I mean she really is I've reached out to her I've really loved the holistic approach you see more of that mm -hmm. in New York and Dallas and y'all people like you are merging it in here you know we we're just so used to the southern yeah yeah. But it's so good for you. Yeah, she she has she has a, a big city flair. I mean, she, she, does. she does. She her style. I'm very drawn to her. She's yeah, adorable. Yeah, she she really does. But um, she uh, she loves it here as well. I mean, yeah, we, we 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 do. We absolutely love it here, and uh, look forward to being here for a while. Well, not only have you helped me personally as well as so many people, you've been a mentor, an example on the community. But I know on the back side, Keesler, with you, your leadership and your team, are very entrenched in the community. I believe approximately, a lot of people don't know this, but I heard through the grapevine, y'all have contributed $2 million into the Mississippi Gulf Coast. And I would love to touch on that a little more. I know it's not your thing to talk about it, but we need to hear about it and encourage others to get involved. And I wanna thank everyone. Don't go away because we will be right back with more from Mr. Andy Swagger. Visit the Gulf Coast's newest casino. Come in today and experience the beautiful, smoke-free Beachview Casino. Pick your game. We have your favorite slots and table games and a sports book. Enjoy incredible views while you dine at one of our many restaurants. And grab a drink while you enjoy live entertainment every weekend in the heart of the action. The Gulf Coast's newest, the smoke-free Beachview Casino Resort, Gulfport. Thank you for calling J. Allen Toyota Service. This is what happens when you set an appointment at J. Allen Toyota Service. We will order the part right then so it'll be here when your appointment comes. Our greeter staff will greet you quickly and friendly and top off your fluids before your car even leaves the drive. Then your car will go to one of our six two-man express teams or one of our 10 certified technicians so they can get you back on the road safely and quickly. This is service the way it should be at J. Allen Toyota Service. Select Ford, get a new 2022 F-150 XLT for $4,000 off, plus 1.9% APR financing. Don't forget, we'll beat your best deal regardless. Beacon of healing, resolute and consistent, determined. We are problem solvers, driven to overcoming obstacles, unshakable. We are prepared, capable, experienced, unbeatable. We are a network of people providing care throughout your lifetime. We are believers in the healing power of compassion. We are Memorial.
So, Andy, I know y'all have doubled in size since you came aboard 2016. But also what a lot of people don't realize is how entrenched you are in the community. You have certain heart and passion for so many. $2 million on this week off coast in that short period of time. That's monumental, and I would love to hear about it. Yeah, um, it, it, it really is. Our, our purpose is different, okay? A lot of folks may cluster us in as a big bank or whatnot. Yeah. Our, our, our purpose is not uh, to, to make more money. Our purpose, it says it right outside on my wall, is to build a better community, mm -hmm. all right? And so we have been very fortunate. Our, our membership is, is, is very loyal to us, and we've, we, we bend over backwards to, to try and, and do everything for them. And their loyalty has given us the ability to give back. Um, we, we, we give back. Yeah, you said the, the number in 2022, it's probably about $2 million. We, we, we literally gave over 15,000 backpacks to kindergartners in Mississippi, Louisiana. The Backpack Buddy nonprofit. It's, it, 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 it was back, called Backpack for Bright Futures. And, and there's oh, a I reason that. for that because uh, this year, th those backpacks weren't just a backpack that said Keesler Federal on it. They are a backpack that, that saved a parent $50 from having to buy this kid's school mm -hmm. supplies. And that's also probably the thing I like the most about the backpack is that the, these kindergartners, you go to school and you, you feel this pressure, like this kid over here has a so Air Jordan backpack, mm -hmm. this kid's got an, all these kids started off with the same, all right? Everybody got the same start and I, and I like that. I like that. It's that, that is what's important to me. Um, we do things, we, we do a lot of things for, for uh, CASA, you know, the CASA organization. Um, we, we gave them a couple hundred thousand dollars to provide bags for these children who have nothing. You know, they have, they have nothing. And that bag that has some, some uh, a teddy bear in it, a blanket, some dental uh, toothbrush and stuff like that, that it doesn't seem like much to, to you and I, but to those kids, it's everything. It is. It really, really is. So th those are just two of the 10 things. And, and like I said before, these initiatives came down, they, they literally came down from the board of directors here. Our mm -hmm. board is laser focused on the community and our members. Mm -hmm. They don't care about any of the, the So they have stuff. perspective like you and the heart. Well, like, I, I, like I said before, they kind of, they kind of put that perspective on me. I, I, I really, was, yeah, yeah. I, I, when I, when I got here, I had that Dallas hard See, I know, in. and you could give it all to your kids. You teach your kids right, too. Uh, absolutely, absolutely. But, uh, but I, I just, I, I, I'm, I feel grateful. I feel fortunate to, to mm -hmm. be here, uh, to be in this position. I love coming to work every day. I love working for an organization that cares. Okay? Yeah. Because that's not the case for, especially with a lot of, big credit unions or banks. No, it's, absolutely. It's, it's all about the, right. the mighty dollar. And, mm -hmm. uh, and here, we're, we are actually, um, we're, we're making an impact on people's lives. And then you put, you know, way more into your job. It becomes a passion, it becomes a purpose. And that's you it. know, you yeah. were saying, you were talking about how that's not the one thing you seek. And I said, well, Andy, it comes to you just tenfold. And you were like, and it's because you're good as gold. You do your job to the full capacity and you're leading amongst a team that's making it happen as well. Yeah, my, so, so talking about leading, um, I don't wanna be the smartest guy in the room. I, I, I've surrounded <laughs> no, myself, I'm not. I've surrounded myself by, around with great people. That's, yeah. that's, that's in my opinion what leaders do. You don't have to know everything. You don't have to in, inspire, inspiring my team. That's important to me, but also uh, surrounding myself with people that are probably better than me. Yeah. Uh, and I'm okay with that. See, I love that because that's one of the things I going into this show. People are like, what inspired you? You know, why do I just shoot for the top? It's not like a form of entitlement or I'm trying to get the CEO. I want to learn. Yeah, yeah. You know, I want those little skills. I want the people in the Chamber of Commerce that are saving up for a car but are going to be the one person in their family that is going to make it. You know, how do, how do we get to this place? Yeah, and what, once, once you think you know everything, you're done. Yes. Uh, so I'm always open. Yeah. I, I feel like you can learn something from everybody. Uh huh. Um, and uh, and I, I think my team feeds off that as well. We mm -hmm. we nobody here is bigger than the team, and that starts with me. Um, this 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 is a team. This is an organization. It's not about one person or a group of people or anything like that. We are we are one team. 
Yeah, and I'll tell you, when I walked in here, I was like, this is next level style boardroom. And you said me and my team are board directors. We're here like last night having a meeting. So y'all work through, I mean. We work through everything. I mean, I'm like, <laughs> wait a minute, that was Sunday. Uh, well, no, 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 not Sunday. That, our, oh, our board okay. meeting was, on, was, was last Thursday. I but, was like. But and <laughs> here's, here's, something about, here's something about my board of directors. My board of directors are volunteers. You go to some of these other financial institutions, these guys get paid hundreds of thousands of dollars. My chairman of the board, he probably works 100 hours a, uh -huh. a, a month. He doesn't get paid anything. He is a volunteer. So um, there's, there's a different mindset here. Yeah. Uh, these, these folks, it's, it's giving back. That's his time. Yeah. You know, he could be doing a, a whole bunch of other things. That's his time that he is giving. And, and we have you know, six other board members that do the same thing. So it's, it's collectively uh, a group of people that are, 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 are really trying to give back. Well, I love that. You know, the older you get, you realize that. It's about serving that happiness that everyone's pursuing. That's where it boils down to. How can I be a part of and help? I was, I was uh, in Dallas before I, I was the CFO. I was an investment banker. And, and you know, it's a lucrative job. Oh, yeah. It, is, it was maybe the most empty <laughs> feeling you have. I hate that feeling. You, you're, you're not, I wasn't doing anything productive. I wasn't right, helping anybody out. Right. And uh, that's where I, I, I knew I, I got to do something different. I have to do something that actually contributes to, to something bigger. Well, I know. And I want to touch on because... I, you know, we have touched, and as people know you, you know, you're always out and about supporting the local mm -hmm. restaurants. Um, you know, you make a point to have your date night and do that, but you're also living your best life now after all this, and what do you do after work? Because I do catch these amazing trips, and the things y'all do are in <laughs> nature. I'm like, yeah. what's going on? Yeah, yeah, so so um, here's the big knock on, on, yeah. on myself. I. When, I, when I'm done here, I uh -huh. turn my phone off. I do not have a social media presence. I'm not on Facebook or I Instagram. I love that. Yeah, so I turn it off and, and we, me and my family, we hang out. My wife and I, we've been on a couple of really cool trips lately. Yeah. We were in, in Florence in Italy, which was awesome. Uh, and then we uh, just recently went to Banff in Canada, which if you've never heard of Banff or uh, are looking for a place to go in the summertime. It is spectacular. How long were y'all there? We we're just we we're there for a week, but yeah. um, it, it just it's wow. it looks it looked like a fairy tale land. Yeah, it really did. And I think that adds too. You know, it contributes to what y'all bring to the coast. You're seeing bigger yeah. things. Yeah, you're learning different cultures, and um, we need more of that. And y'all are a young couple. I mean, relatively. Oh, thanks. Yeah. I mean, you know, that's <laughs> another thing. Like y'all. Y'all are making it happen, and beautiful family. Yeah. Well, thank you. And, and family's everything yeah. to myself and, and to my wife. Mm -hmm. um, and and uh, thank you for saying that we're young, all right? Well, uh, I mean, y'all are. It's not okay. like y'all are 90. And no, no, no. Not 90, but, you know, usually yeah. when people are, they reach a place in life, yeah. they're yeah. a little bit older. So yeah. it's pretty cool to see young, yeah. ambitious people. So so it's, it's, it's funny that you say that because, um, you know, I, I have I – have, 800 over 800 em employees on our team and here in Biloxi well here just oh all over all, for yeah, you double yeah, okay yeah so um a, a lot of them are, are younger and, and they uh -huh. see me and they, they they think they oh man kind of a young guy for for yeah. this I've been doing this for 20 years you started this is off my 20th at year yeah doing this so I'm like yeah I might be a little younger but I've I've got a couple miles on me. <laughs> and did you always want to do this? Where did you graduate college? I went to Kent State University in Ohio, okay. and uh, and and I, I wanted to I wanted to be, I grew up wanting to be an investment banker. You know, it's like, like you want this, you want this uh, prestigious job and all this. Yeah. And, and, and I did it. Um, I feel like I've always been able to do uh, if I put my mind to something, I can get it done. But it just wasn't what I wasn't my true calling. Yeah, you just kept, and you constantly were escalating to different levels. Mm -hmm. And being down here, do you see with the Mississippi Gulf Coast, you know, growing? Do you see you doubling and continuing this path of oh, success? Oh goodness, this since we've been here, it just feels like this whole place has changed. I mean, it has. things being built now, restaurants here that were never, you know, concepts that were mm -hmm. typically you find in cities are now here. Right. Um, so so yeah. And, and Keesler Federal, look, we're, we're not 
to me, it's we're, our success is not measured by size. Right. Our success is measured by our, how good we are, the, the quality mm -hmm. of what we're doing, not the quantity, it's the quality. If we ever got so big that uh, our service levels dropped and, and uh, we, we, we didn't have the same value that we have now, we'll, we'll hit the brakes because it's all about quality. Yeah, absolutely. And that's very, that's very, you know, important to stress that. But when you see this and you have the facts and you read the newspaper mm -hmm. and go online, the fact is you have doubled and tripled and your morals and values. I feel blessed to let the coast hear what a day of the CEO, Andy Swagger, of the person making this happen because you're going out, your motives and heart are pure and you're making it happen. Yeah, and it's, 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 a, it's a team. It's a, yeah, team. I love it's a that. big team and uh, we're all pulling in the same direction. Yeah. And, uh, you know, I, I, and like I said before, I, I'm so grateful. I feel very fortunate to be a part of this team. Well, your gratitude is contagious <laughs> and you have definitely made Coastal Connections with Courtney's Day. And thank you for this opportunity. Thank you. And I appreciate it. You got it. And thank you everyone for tuning in on another Sunday to Coastal Connections with Courtney. Thank you for calling J. Allen Toyota Service. This is what happens when you set an appointment at J. Allen Toyota Service. We will order the part right then so it'll be here when your appointment comes. Our greeter staff will greet you quickly and friendly and top off your fluids before your car even leaves the drive. Then your car will go to one of our six two-man express teams or one of our 10 certified technicians so they can get you back on the road safely and quickly. This is service the way it should be at J. Allen Toyota Service. for $1,000 off MSRP, plus a 3.9% APR for up to 72 months. Don't forget, we'll beat your best deal regardless. Visit the Gulf Coast's newest casino. Come in today and experience the beautiful, smoke-free Beachview Casino. Pick your game. We have your favorite slots and table games and a sports book. Enjoy incredible views while you dine at one of our many restaurants. And grab a drink while you enjoy live entertainment every weekend in the heart of the action. The Gulf Coast's newest, the smoke-free Beachview Casino Resort, Gulfport.